are going to create a mini bouquet. Today is going to be the time. This is the time for the night lap. And we are going to create a volcano. It's very, very dangerous. And it will destroy every living thing on Earth. Prepare to die! So embarrassing. Okay, now, this is going to be the best time of my life because finally this experiment has come to life! This room is getting lit! And we are going to have so much fun! Now remember in my last video or the part one of Volcanoes? Yeah, the one that I told you that I will be back in part two? This is part two and we are going to see a beautiful English. Let the science begin. Now, come on, I'll show you the materials. Welcome to Zazas and Zizi's Fun Ventures, where learning is having fun. Now first, we have a big bottle. You have to have a bottle like this, and it's six liters. And then you cut it into this piece. Just like this, because this would be the outer area of the volcano. And then you'll need a small bottle, because this is where we'll put the vinegar. And also a baby bottle because we'll need this baby bottle for the inside and the magma chamber and the vent oh and this is a DIY fun and we cut it out from a bottle and it's just a part of this and we can get um, a bowl and the bottle cup. Ooh, big giant bundle of glue. Some baking powder. Ooh, vinegar. Whoa. Oh, and we also have some cut pieces of manila paper. This is for the texture of the volcano. Oh, and the fun part, we even get to put toys! And it's just like it's a, the real time of the dinosaurs. And I'll also put a decayed tree so that it's just like it's a wasteland. And a couple of dinos. And, you'll, and I'll get a marker because we're going to put a seed. But that'll be later and I won't show it in the video. And now, here comes the tools! Now first we have a hand drill. Oh, we have a glue gun and don't forget the glue sticks too. And this is what is used to stick the baby bottle onto the ground so that it's just like glue. We've got to have some double-sided tape and ordinary tape. Oh, and some red juice powder so that it's definitely like lava. You know, you definitely want to do this. And a paintbrush. Oh, and the manila paper. I forgot. This is the manila paper. My dad's going to put it. I don't even know what this is. And the best part, the goggles. Now, and we are going to wear this because... There might be some stuff that will fly into my eyes. And also, I'm a scientist. And I wear goggles. Okay. And it'll look cool. I, and also, do you remember that I wear this in the snow video? Okay, okay. Ooh. Okay, 
Why looks so special? Our mini volcano is finished. But we didn't get to paint it because we didn't have the materials and we couldn't go out and buy some because of the quarantine. And also it takes time. And we intended to leave this part open so that the camera over here could see the reaction. And we also put some toy dinosaurs to portray the volcanic eruption theory of the extinction of dinosaurs. And also, my dad put a river. But we couldn't color it blue. Well, very sad, but that's okay because it's just a drought and the volcano will erupt. And I know what to do first, right? Gonna make this. Wait, I better put my goggles right away. This is the baking soda that we're going to pour. And now, are we going to pour all of this? Mm. Good. Look at that. Oh, this looks just so yummy. It looks like sand. I, I want to stir it. I want to stir it. Good, we're stirring it up, stirring it up, stirring it up. We are now mixing the powdered juice and the baking soda. Sis, what are you doing here? Okay. I think we still need to mix it a little bit more. To make the color of the lava. Hmm, 
I guess this is okay now. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm finally going to be a scientist. Where are my goggles and skills? Bacon soda squishing all around. Good, so good. No. Good, and we're... Put the funnel here. Make sure it's perfectly fitted because that's how we made it. Pretty genius, right? Then we're going to pour this all. Oh yes. Oof, 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 oof. No, oh, no, I have to wear goggles. I have to wear goggles, okay. Good. It's just like sand. Okay. So what are we gonna do next? Oh, the vinegar. Okay, let's hold this. Okay, let's try, let's try. Wow, it's just like the liquids. Like the liquid that you find in the hospital. Like when you have a sickness. Now let the liquids flow because the volcano is sick. Once. Is it flowing now? Okay, brace myself. It's going up instead. I see bubbles going up. Are you serious? Why is this happening? Magma chamber? Yeah. 
When it's still inside of the volcano, it's called magma. Oh, and when it's already out, it's lava. And it is lava. And it's turning into lava. It's becoming lava. Come on. It's still boiling. It's still boiling? Okay. I thought that this would be a more epic experiment. I thought it would just... But it, it's just it's going very slow, but I still have it. Hmm? Oh, guys, it's getting pretty messy. Oh, no. Well, guys, bye. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Bye. Uh, oh, no, what is happening? Gaza. Wait, wait, wait. The video isn't done yet. Now, I'm going to tell you the reaction of vinegar and baking soda. When vinegar and baking soda are first mixed together, hydrogen ions in the vinegar react with the sodium and bicarbonate ions in the baking soda. This initial reaction results in two new chemicals, carbonic acid and sodium acetate. The second reaction is a decomposition reaction. You may want to try this at home. Hey guys, it is me, Zizi, and I am finally. Wait, no, 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 again. Nani? Where's my.